Hi again, my name's Tim and welcome back to the channel. So today we're gonna do another hike. We were on the leeward side. Well, first let me introduce you to the rest of the gang. Levi, Lindsay, and Reagan. My son, his wife, uh, Lindsay, and my granddaughter, Reagan. So we are gonna hike the Vermont Nature Trail. We're right at the, what I call the trailhead. Light rain, as you can see. Um, but they say it's about a two hour hike. So we're gonna hike about an hour up and an hour back. But we're gonna see, I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing a lot of um, tropical birds and noises and plants and just seeing what the interior of St. Vincent, this uh, Vermont trail is sort of on the leeward side of the, of the island. Um, we haven't done much exploring on the leeward side yet, just for, because of time constraints. But um, this is gonna be our first hike and you can see the weather's a little bit overcasty. Hopefully it'll, it'll stop and we'll get some blue skies. But um, yep, so we're gonna begin the hike and see where it leads us. Oh yeah, coming right off the mountain. All this water coming down there, look at that. Talk about a really tropical rainfall setting. This is definitely, definitely cool. Very, very nice. Very lush, deep, covered. Sun can barely sneak through here because of all the greenery up top. That's probably why we don't feel as much rain, probably we're getting protected by the canopy. See the mountain stream down below, all the way at the, bo the bottom, and they created all these little bridges to go over the little tributaries that flow down to that stream and all meet down at the stream. Still very, very covered by the, the trees. I'm wondering whether we're going to hit a spot where it opens up. Nothing yet so far. Okay, here's the first really, really big old wide rooted tree on the trail. This tree's got to be a couple hundred years old for it to grow like that for this long. Look at the way the roots are. Very broad, tall roots rooted into this mountainside here very nice some of these trees they put dates and tell you what 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 type of tree it is and how long they think it's been around but this one it doesn't look like they have any signs on it we'll have to keep our eyes open these roots are really cool they look like they have little little pools that they catch capture the water see right here this is all enclosed and I saw a couple little puddles up there but you know when it rains down heavy all the water will get trapped inside this root structure So I love the way that these little rocky streams just meander the way down through the through the jungle here. All the water and rain working its way down into the towns and towards the coastline. Really nice. All right, we stopped at this uh, sanity tree, buttress giants. You can see Reagan at the base of this tree. How how big this thing is. Another one of these trees that's probably several hundred years old. It's been here probably since the beginning of this rainforest. Very cool. Okay, we're at the one mile rest stop. Through the trees here, you can see a uh, surrounding, what I would call mountaintop. Very, very tall peak. Trees all the way up. I don't know how well they can see it through this GoPro since I'm not zoomed. But you can tell we're getting up in elevation now. Looks like there's some blue skies and the rain stops, so hopefully it'll get a little nicer as we get to the top. Okay, every time I thought I saw the biggest tree of this species, we see another one. The buttress roots on this thing are huge. That one, it must be almost five feet tall. These things are massive. Very nice. Here we go again. Incredible. Another huge, huge intertwined rooting of a very, very, very tall tree. You can't even see how tall it is because you can't see through the canopy. But look at the rooting stretch on this bad boy. Really, really wide. First guy. Welcome to the Parrot Lookout. The endangered St. Vincey bird. Parrot 
is the national bird of St. Vincent and the Grenades and is totally protected. It numbers over just 500 in the wild. This reserve was established to protect the unique bird and its habitat. However, the Vinci is still in, in danger. Volcanic eruptions, hurricanes, deforestation, and illegal Illegal pet trade all threaten its survival. Great. Beautiful little look out here. Hear the parrot? Wait, listen. Shh, listen. Parrot. Parrot. Okay, I just stopped to, to, to take a quick video of this little little mountain stream all the way down there. I don't know if you can see it through the trees, but there's a cool little stream with water flowing down through the bottom of this valley. Look at this massive, massive boulder. Huge. All right, we're heading back down. This is the bridge we saw on the way up. So we're pretty close to the bottom now. Let me just give you a little view of the little stream, little rocky stream heading down. Very nice. Another Jamungus tree with the broad roots. Go way up. Okay, Reagan, what did you think of the Vermont Trail hike? Well, I like the, green, the greenery, and I the fan size out because I saw all of the beautiful plants. Mm -hmm. Sadly, I didn't see any birds, but... Well, we heard a few, we just didn't see them. Maybe next time, I'm sure we'll do this again. It was well worth the, well worth the hike. Okay. Okay, we're back at the first bridge at the, the bottom of the trail you see um, Levi Lindsay and Reagan went down to put their wash their hands in the water and see get close to the water coming down from the mountain I imagine this water is pretty cool it looks very clean too very nice hike I would highly recommend it it's um, has a couple spots where it's a little bit steeper but then it has some flat spots and then there's some rest stops up top when you get to the midway point they have a nice little but I would say canary or bird lookout where you can sit there and you get a tremendous breeze where it opens up from the mountainside. So all in all, really nice, nice couple hour hike if you're in into like the tropical rainforest type setting. It was a little wet today, so it might might have been a little cooler, but um, we certainly appreciated that. So I hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you next time.